Hey y'all, it's Alicia and welcome back to Alicia's Crafty Hoblop. And if you're new here, welcome. We know there are several of you who are new and we're, it's really nice to see you like entering and participating in challenges. And we hope you continue to do that and to speak up. To my returning folks, oh, it's so good to be back with you. I know it was only a few days, but it felt like forever. I am officially done, y'all. I'm officially done. Yep, grades are entered. So your girl is finished. I know it's like seven o'clock on a Tuesday and I'm not in class. No, I'm not. No, I didn't get done today what I thought I would. Uh, between having to upload the grades and quite frankly, laziness. I didn't do a whole lot. Nope, not even half my to-do list got crossed off and I'm okay with that for today. What I did do, however, was open some happy mail. All right, the first one. Look at this adorable thing. So this came from Donna Dreams. And it's a cross between a llama and a unicorn. And I love it. Now, if my granddaughter gets a peek of this, my one granddaughter, I have three granddaughters, by the way, but one of them will steal this from me. <laughs> and she's feisty. She might win. So I got to hide this from her. But um, yeah, she actually, I actually got to talk to her today. Oh, she's getting so big. Uh, but she has like a big personality. And she will love this. But I also love it. So I'm going to have to guard it. But Donna sent not only this. She made handmade soap for everybody. All the women in the building. Isn't that thoughtful? I couldn't believe it. They, Oh my gosh. It's just like such a way to brighten up their whole week. We're a little nervous here. I don't know if you all heard. But there, there's a lot of pressure on our governor to open New York. So he doesn't want to, but he's afraid there'll be a presidential order that's going to force him to open. And he doesn't want that to happen. So he's going to do what he calls this weekend a slow roll. He's going to open some very small things. And he's hoping that's going to stave off pressure to open up everything. Uh, but he's not sure. So keep your fingers crossed, y'all, because he's worried that if we reopen, it's going to be mayhem. So hopefully his plan will work. But that soap came just at the right time, Donna, when all the women in here are worried. So thank you. Thank you. Like that was a way to brighten their whole week, really. And then she also sent, now the box was super heavy because there were a ton of gloves in this box. Now we can now get hand sanitizer at the supermarket and we can get, we still can't get antibacterial soap at the supermarket or the pharmacy, but we can order it from Walmart. It takes about a week and a half, but we can get it. Um, but we still can't get gloves. So thank you. Thank you. And thank you. And thank you for my lavender soap. I love lavender so much, folks. I love, this is one of my favorite smells in the whole world. And so is chocolate. And she sent me both. So Donna Dreams makes beautiful cards. She makes beautiful projects. And oh my goodness, she can make amazing soap. I know because I already have a bar on the go in there. And it's amazing soap. Why does that not surprise me? Remarkable. But that was not my only Happy Meal. So you all know that I'm doing a special swap with Cruz. And it's a really fun swap. And I encourage you all to do it. Um, and you can set a limit if you want to. But basically, I I can't remember where we saw it. I saw it, I saw it on a YouTube video where two friends who know each other quite well did a swap where they bought for each other surprise things that they thought the other person would love but would never buy for themselves. And then they swapped them. So Cruz and I are doing the same thing, only we added one made item. So, because we didn't just want to buy each other things. So most of the items I'm shipping Cruz from here, but I did ship one directly already to her house. And she shipped me one too. Um, and I'm excited to share it with you. So y'all know that my one collection that I did buy for myself for the summer was one of a kind. But I only bought the starter pack. I bought the starter pack because I thought it'd be a pretty good deal. It was like $10. It came with some sheets and some stickers. Actually, it wasn't such a great deal. They often are, but this really wasn't such a good deal. You only got a few sheets of the 12 by 12. They had the stickers, no ephemera. It did, however, have the journaling cards, which I loved. And I was surprised. I actually loved them the most out of everything. Well, Cruz got me the peachy cheap deal. So... It's got like the sentiment stickers that I did not get. It's got the ephemera. And I had not ordered it because it still was kind of pricey. 
at scrapbook.com. It was like $6.95, so I didn't order it yet. I was waiting for a sale. Look at it. It's so good. Um, so it, it came with a 6x6 six six paper pad and another pack of the journaling card. So I am so happy. Um, this was a great deal. Oh, and some, and some regular stickers. So I am thrilled with this. So this is Cruz's surprise gift number one, and she's right. I wasn't going to order this because it was still $6.95. And I think Cruz was worried that by the time I did, it was going to be gone. And she was probably right, it would have been. So this was a great. So this was swap gift number one, y'all. And a pretty amazing one. So thank you, Cruz. I will put both Donna Dreams and Crafting Con Cruz's channels down below. But I know many of you know them. If you don't, they're both amazing ladies who make in completely different styles from one another, both super creative, and you want to get to know them better, both as people and as makers. Our angels have been hard at work, y'all. All sorts of little things going out. I know. I know because I'm getting copied on some of the shipments. So they're hard at work right now, and I think that it's really, it's going to be a month of uplifting spirits. Now, please don't forget that we have our challenge on for Miss Pat Sweeney. That's our crafty love challenge for this month. I'll put a link to that down below. And if I remember, I'll put an end screen. You know, y'all, you can't put the end screen on until after the video loads. And so sometimes I just forget. That's what happens when you get older and your brain is on all different things. Wishing for you the happy... Oh, and I froze my video. All right, y'all. Wishing for you the happiest evening, a creative evening, and I'll see y'all real soon. Bye for now.